Hi guys, today I'm back with some more nail foil earrings. I wanted to use a more white base, so I've just got this sort of white creamish pigment powder out of that set from Amazon. And I've added it to some epoxy resin and I'm just going to first make the bases. I'm going to use the diamond shape this time and the middle size. So I'm just going to make these bases. Okay, I'll let them sit for a while and then I will pop any bubbles with my heat gun and I will let them cure for at least 48 hours and I'll be back for the next step. And as you can see, that's just giving me a nice white flat base to work with in the diamond shape. And today I'm going to give out this, try out this nail foil. It is a beautiful shell pattern. And we'll see what that turns out like. So just going to go in with my nail foil glue here and I'm just going to give each of these a coating. Make sure that the whole base is covered. Okay, so I'm just going to go in with a piece that I've cut off from both of them. Just going to pat that down. Make sure there's no air bubbles. And now I'm going to drag over my UV lamp and I'm just going to give them 90 seconds under the lamp and I'll be back. Okay, so they've had 90 seconds under the UV lamp. And now it's time to try and peel these off. Gosh, my gloves are a bit sticky. Wow, I love that shell pattern. Okay. Oh, here, straight here. There's that one. Oh, wow, that's just so pretty. Okay, so I'm just going to get my little sander and give them a bit of a quick sand on the edges just to get rid of that glue residue from the nail foil glue. And I'll be back with the next step. Okay, so I have just cleaned the edges up and I've also used a little alcohol wipe there to clean off any excess residue off the edges there obviously not touching the top and now I am going to go in with these and give them a clear UV resin doming just to protect the top so I'm just going to put some resin on the top and spread it to the edges and 
I'd also, I'm going to try and go around the hole with the resin so that I don't have to re-drill. Okay, I'm going to drag over my UV lamp and I'm going to give them three minutes, a good three minutes underneath there just to make sure they're really hardened up and I'll be back with the finished product. And there you have it guys, a finished product and haven't they turned out so nice. Gosh, I love that shell pattern. It's so pretty. Now I just used this mold here to make some white bases and I've also, once they're dried, domed the top as well with some clear UV resin to give it a bit of shine. I've added the jump ring and I've got a back there with a dab of UV resin to cure as well. Well, totally give this nail foil a go guys. They've turned out great. Well, thanks for watching and catch me next time for some more resin mold testing. Bye guys.